Hello everyone and welcome you all to Quick Solutions for All India Akash Test Series Medical 2020. Today I am going to take up the zoology part of the paper which is test paper number 3 code A and B in zoology. So let's get started with our very first question. Question number 136. To increase herd size in a short time, multiple ovulation embryo transfer technology is not demonstrated in and the options given are cattle, sheep, mares and frogs and we know that multiple ovulation embryo transfer technology is abbreviated as MOIT and this technology has been demonstrated for cattle, sheep and mares for cattle, sheep and mares in which fertilized eggs are transferred to surrogate mothers. So these cannot be the correct answer. Option number four, frogs are amphibians which exhibit external fertilization. So fertilized structure is not transferred into their body. So this is a correct answer to our question because frogs are amphibians. And they exhibit external fertilization. So, the correct answer to our question is option number 4. Let's discuss our next question. Question number 137. Colostrum is very essential to impart immunity to the newborn because it contains and the options are immunoglobulin A, macrophages, monocytes and natural killer cells and the correct answer to this question is option number 1 immunoglobulin A because colostrum is a yellowish fluid produced from the mammary glands of a nursing or lactating mother for 25 to 48 hours after delivery which is important in transfer of IgA or immunoglobulin A to the newborn. So the correct answer is option number one. This transfer of immunoglobulin A provides natural passive immunity to the newborn whereas macrophages, monocytes and natural killer cells provide innate immunity that is present at the time of birth. So these cannot be the correct answer. So the correct answer to our question is option number one. Let's discuss our next question. Question number 138. Heroin is synthesized by and the options are nitration of morphine, glycosylation of morphine, acetylation of morphine and the last option is methylation of morphine. And we know that heroin is commonly called as smack is chemically chemically diacetyl morphine and is obtained by acetylation of morphine. So the correct answer to this question is option number 3 whereas rest of the options nitration of morphine, glycosylation of morphine and methylation of morphine cannot be the correct answer. So the correct answer is option number 3. Let's discuss our next question. Question number 139. Choose the correct statement with respect to animal breeding. Let's discuss the options first. The very first statement given is in breeding selects harmful recessive genes that always increase fertility and productivity. The second statement is in breeding helps in accumulation of superior genes and elimination of undesirable genes. Third statement says in breeding decreases homozygosity and the last statement is outbreeding is essential to evolve pure lines in any animal and we know that option number two inbreeding helps in accumulation of superior genes and elimination of undesirable genes is a correct statement and is the correct answer to our question. Let's discuss other options also. Now option number three inbreeding decreases homozygosity is an incorrect statement because inbreeding increases homozygosity. So option number three is an incorrect statement. Also inbreeding is necessary if we want to evolve a pure line of any animal. So option number four that outbreeding is essential to evolve pure lines in any animal is an incorrect statement because it is inbreeding which is essential to evolve pure lines in any animal. 
Also, inbreeding exposes harmful recessive genes that are eliminated by selection and continued inbreeding usually reduces fertility and even productivity. So option number one, inbreeding selects harmful recessive genes that always increase fertility and productivity is an incorrect statement. So the correct answer to this question is option number two. Let's discuss our next question. Question number 140. Immune response primarily responsible for rejection of kidney graft is and the options given are cell mediated immune response, inflammatory immune response, humoral immune response and autoimmune response. So the correct answer to this question is option number one because cell mediated immune response comprising cytotoxic T cells. is chiefly responsible for graft rejection. So the correct answer to this question is option number one. Now we know that the immune response to a transplant organ consists of both cellular and humoral mechanism. Although other cell types are also involved but T cells or cellular mediated immune response or cell mediated immune response are central in the rejection of graft. So option number three humoral immune response cannot be the correct answer. Also, initially, early inflammation is observed as innate response against tissue transplantation, but T cells have a critical role in acute rejection or acute tissue rejection. So, option number two, inflammatory immune response cannot be a correct answer. Now, the last option given is autoimmune response and this cannot be a correct answer because autoimmune response is immune response to self antigens also responsible for graft rejection still adaptive immune response via T cells act as a major barrier to effective transplantation. So the correct answer to this question is option number one. Let's discuss our next question.